You look like you've just seen the end of the cosmos, mate. I know the feeling. We're on the edge of it, and it's time to play your part, scene. Me and you, we're blood now, yeah? Templars but a win in that. Never mind. Looks like you've got some training to do before you're ready for your first kill. You want to do what your letter says. Go speak with Sonak at the Templar's gaff. It's not far. You can't miss it. Honest, it's unmissable. Come in. Come in. I'm very pleased you can follow directions on the back of a card. It is the basis for us getting along famously. Of course, with an establishment like this, we're practically in the yellow pages under Crusaders. Richard Sonak. So, you heeded our call to arms. You have questions, I can furnish you with answers. Some answers. To begin with, you haven't strayed into some atrocious Dan Brown airport paperback. We are not the Knights Templar. That particular appellation went out in the 1300s along with page boy haircuts and burnings at the stake. No, we run a 21st century, well, let's say a forward-facing organization, but one with its strength in ancient bonds of tradition, in loyalty, in blood, and, to be perfectly frank, in a sizable private army. Our firm guidance is needed to save the world from itself. We have kept the matters of squabbling secret societies and loathsome dimensions discreet. Until the shadows began to peel back across the globe, until these darkest of days came upon us. Now, the evidence is on television, for pity's sake. We are at war. Might will make right, and it will fall upon us to judge the correct application of might. It falls upon you, as a soldier of the Templars. Show me that you have the will, and we can teach you the way. Your remarkable powers can be honed and controlled at least to less disastrous effect on property values. There is a private training area which we have reinforced for just that purpose. Come back and see me after. <laughs>